The hot new game for the iPhone, iPod Touch, and iPad is a farm tending social game called We Rule, and it's totally not Farmville. Nope, not one bit. App Judgment is brought to you by GoDaddy. Welcome to App Judgment Revision 3's mobile phone application review show. I'm Mauricio Balvanera. Now, I really feel like the App Store is hitting its stride lately in the game department, and I have a feeling it's due to the release of the iPad this past weekend. We Rule is a prime example. Arlene, our producer, and I have been playing the game for the better part of the week. Oh, I've been playing for a month. Yes, well, Eileen is the We Rule expert here, but we decided to give you a review from the perspective of a farming noob like moi. So when you start off, you sign in and create a plus user account. This is going to keep track of your progress, crop status, and social network, as we'll get into in a bit. You're given a very tiny plot of land and a tiny bit of money. Your first task is to create a farm, then plant and harvest corn. This is going to take, oh... 45 seconds. Right, and that's going to score you one experience, or XP points. Get enough of these XP points by harvesting crops, collecting taxes on home you build, or simply by decorating your farm and upgrading structures, and you level up. Kind of like playing Warcraft or um, Farmville. But it's not Farmville. But it's totally not Farmville, because there's no way in hell you'll ever catch me playing that game. OK, fast forward a tad bit. With each level you gain, you unlock new fruit and vegetables to plant, each new level typically taking longer and longer to harvest. I'm currently at level six, and as you can see, wheat will take you five minutes, onions, one hour, squash, five hours, carrots, 12 hours, and beans will take you one whole day, 24 hours. Once you get to Eileen's level, you get items like... We get a watermelon. You have to wait for 16 hours. Peas are only 30 minutes. Strawberries are an hour and a half, and potatoes are six hours. I like those, those are sturdy. Right, now this is all real time. There's no pretend 12 hours that actually takes two minutes. No, if you plant a carrot at noon, you're gonna have to harvest them at midnight that night, or else your carrots will wither and die and you have to clean up the mess. Now, it's a lot like those old Tamagotchi keychains you had to tend to all day long, or um, kind of like Farmville. But it's totally not like Farmville. Totally not Farmville. Luckily, We Rule gives you these nifty push notification options for each crop you plant. So if you have to step away, and you will, you'll receive a little reminder. There is one exception to the real-time waiting rule. With each level you attain, you get a few bottles of what's called Mojo. Crops will grow instantly in exchange for these Mojo credits, speeding up the development of your farm considerably. If you want more Mojo, you can, of course, make an in-app purchase of Mojo Flask for $4.99. These are real-life dollars, people, and this, my friend, is why the game is free. If you're truly invested into the game and you've friended other farmers, you've entered the Jedi mind trick that is We Rule. Friendly competition is the mother of motivation, which translates to buying these damn virtual flasks of Mojo. Now, speaking of other farmers, you may have noticed that before I went into my plot of land, there were other plots of land around me. These are your sworn enemies. Oh, no, 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 these are your friends. And you work together and um, you collaborate. It's a really, really cool social thing. All right, see, I'm used to Warcraft where the point of building all these headquarters and armies and stuff is to attack the next town over. I guess there's no barracks to build and we rule. Oh, actually, yes, there is. You uh, train fighters in the guild. All right, we're gonna make sense of this friend relationship as well as go over pros and cons after we rock our sponsor. Thanks to GoDaddy for sponsoring this episode of App Judgment. Get reliable, secure web hosting without the long-term contract. GoDaddy's hosting plans are bigger and better than ever with 99.9% .9 uptime, free 24-7 support, and no annual commitment. Check out revision3.com slash GoDaddy for a list of all the amazing GoDaddy deals from Rev3. And use the code JUDGE8 to get 10% off any order. All right, as you can see, I have a few friends I can interact with. These farmers, such as Eileen, who have an open sign above their farm are offering services. So when I fish for you, I reap the rewards, I get the coins and the experience, and you get the coins and the experience. It's sort of a cooperative thing. You can also do various things like uh, ask someone to make cupcakes in their bakery, uh, build science projects, uh, you know, build lumber, chop lumber, 
various things once you start building, building out your town. It's pretty cool. Now I've just begun to scratch the surface of social aspects and I gotta say, that's where half the fun lies. The other half lies in the zen-like experience of maintaining a virtual farm. I was tempted at first to list no fighting as a con in the gameplay experience, but the genius of Farmville, we rule, we rule I mean, is that no fighting is a pro. Imagine the calming effect of maintaining a bonsai tree. What's the point of it? Nothing really. It's fun through patience and aesthetics, which is why you're gonna be spending a lot of time rearranging your farm purely for aesthetic reasons. Another pro, push notifications. Another con, push notifications. It's completely possible to get over Zen by Farmville. We rule! I also wish you can zoom in just a little further into the map, but the iPhone version is already a memory hog and pushing 33 megabytes, and the iPad HD version comes in rocking at 35 megabytes. I'll settle with what we have now. Eileen, any more pros and cons to add? Well, the biggest con is that the server's kind of wonky at times, and the game is a bit buggy. So you'll see things that aren't really happening, you'll have to come out of the game and uh, re-enter. And it takes a long time to load the game. Now, the thing is, I asked a few Facebookers and Twitter friends to explain to me what Farmville was and how you played it. The responses could explain We Rule without any modifications. What We Rule adds to the mix rather successfully is the business-oriented, ballsy, rule with an iron fist feel that allows me to say, download this app with no qualms. All right, if you download the game, definitely add me as a friend. You can find me at Mal Brown Cow. Got an app you'd like us to review? Send us an email at appjudgment at revision3.com. You can also find us at Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, or our homepage at revision3.com slash appjudgment. Also, stick around for some rather sexy unboxing of Apple's new iPad at the end of this episode. Catch you guys next time. Hey there, beautiful. I'm the delivery guy. I've got a package for you. This is no time for business time. We got to get to some unboxing porn. Unbox. Brought to you by GoDaddy. We got a special delivery, and it's dying to get out of its stuffy cardboard and polycarbonate packaging with the help of my lovely ladies. Hi. What are we unboxing today, ladies? Oh, it's Apple's new iPod. iPad. iPod. iPad. Ladies, I know a thing or two about gadgets, and I'm pretty sure that's a giant iPod. No, look! Will you look at that? A typo. Ugh. Don't get me wrong, ladies. I'm pretty excited about this vessel of magic and revolution. It's the sexiest way to experience America online. By far the best, if not the most expensive digital photo frame you'll ever own. OMG Behold! Ooh. The Virgin iPod. iPad! Calling out to its lucky owner. Caress me. Multi-touch me. Unimpress me. Now, now, ladies. You may not be impressed now, but you may change your mind if we give that tab a tug and pull that thing out. That's what she said. What? Nothing. This sexy mother Shut your mouth. is sporting 802.11 ABGN Wi-Fi, Bluetooth 2.1, a digital compass, accelerometer, microphone, and ambient light sensor. Why don't we dive deeper into this box first? That's what she said. What? Nothing. Will you look at that? Those Californians sure do know how to design pulling tabs. And oh, look, documentation. Spread them out, baby. Leaf through it. Read up on those FCC frequency bands. And look, hee <laughs> hee, you know where you can put these, ladies. Over your mouth? Yes. No. USB. That's right, ladies. 
USB something something. 2.0. And a tiny computer to sync to. No, 10 watt charging adapter. What? What? I feel like we were shorted on hardware to handle and I'm left wanting more. That's what she said. What? Nothing. Let's go for the money shot. Yeah. Slow down. Yeah. We've got this hot 9.7 inch solid LED screen. That's LED. This is the Dorothy button. Home button. Because there's no place like home. Along the edges, we have its attitude adjusters. Volume and rotation lock. Erogenous zone. On, off. Same difference. And I don't think I need to explain what these two holes are. Please don't. Headphone jack and microphone, you dirty birds. Prepare yourself, ladies, for the hottest out-of-the-box experience you'll ever have. Fail. Ladies, I swear this never happens to me. I'm usually up and running right away. We finish up syncing some new applications and boom, let's do this. The greatest computing device ever made. It's perfect. No multitasking. Son of a. Shut your mouth. Fabulous HD movies. Not to widescreen. I don't need widescreen on my pod. Pad. Pod. Ladies, if it looks like a duck and quacks like a duck, it's... Oh, ladies, that was good. Yeah? Impeccable timing. Thanks. Is that game optimized for the iPad? No. It still looks great even blown up. I know, huh? It's a giant freaking iPod, ladies, and I'm perfectly happy with it. No camera. I don't need one. No flash. Well, if I don't have a camera, why would I need a flash? Let's go to your favorite website. Now we're talking, ladies. I'd love me some supplementation to our pleasure time. What the hell is that? No flash. So, the giant iPod, iPod. doesn't have a camera, won't multitask, and won't play my pornographic movie? I'm so sorry. <sighs> well, if Apple says I don't need my porn, I'm okay with that. Pardon? This gadget is so sexy and made by Apple. What? Shut your mouth, ladies, and fire up that GoDaddy app. I need to register unboxingporn.com. We may be onto something here. Now our viewers will want to make sure we are who we claim to be. No fishing site here. Luckily, GoDaddy offers the ironclad protection of a GoDaddy.com secure certificate. Protection! That's right, ladies. Like a web prophylactic. I've got a dirty little secret. Use the code REV8 for 10% off any order you place. The hookup. Yes. And if you go to revision3.com slash GoDaddy, you can take a peek at a secret list of GoDaddy deals from Revision 3. It's our secret. We should do this again soon, ladies. You and I, we have chemistry. Like arsenic. I don't know what that means, but I'll take that as a maybe.